Hey guys, Taylor here. And as you guys can clearly already see, nothing really major has really changed about me except the length of my hair. I promise you guys, this is not a wig. Look, not a wig. Ow, ow. This is my real, actual hair. The long hair is gone. So today I just decided to go ahead and talk to you guys about the haircut, why I initially decided to get the haircut, and just stuff about the haircut that I just kind of wanted to share with you guys. And before we get started, yes, I am sick yet again, so please excuse the nasally type voice of mine today. Alrighty guys, so let's go ahead and talk about this haircut. Surprisingly, I've been wanting to get my haircut for a while now. And I only told my mom and my dad, and I only told my brother and my older sister about it. And the only best friend of mine that I told about this was my best friend Jillian. She was the only one, out of all the friends that I have, she was the only one I actually told about this. So they were the only people who knew I wanted to get this done. Now, cutting off my hair and donating it to an organization like Wigs for Kids or Locks of Love is nothing really entirely new to me because I have done it once before six years ago when I got a big chunk of my hair cut off. I was 15 the first time that I actually donated my hair and I thought that it was such an incredible idea to go ahead and cut my hair off and then donate it to someone who has cancer and who may actually need it for a wig. So I figured that I would go ahead and do that again because it felt so good the last time and also it makes me feel less nervous about getting a ton of my hair chopped off. The last time that I got my hair donated, I decided to donate my hair to Wix for Kids. And so I was thinking about what organization I wanted to donate my hair to this time. And I decided to go ahead and donate my hair to Wix for Kids again. If you guys don't know what Wix for Kids is, it is a wonderful and amazing organization that allows people to donate 10 inches or more of their hair to help provide a wig for a child with either cancer or Appalachia. And Wix for Kids gives the families and these children these wigs for absolutely free. They don't cost a penny. They don't even cost a dime. It's absolutely free for these families and that child to get their wig. I decided to donate my hair because I love to give. If there is one gift that you can give to someone that can outbe any of the hottest products in the world, it's giving. I just love to give. I'm a person who just generally likes to give and to help others. So it made me feel a little bit less nervous about the haircut that I'm helping somebody in need. And that alone is a very awesome feeling to have. So on Wednesday, I have decided. So on Wednesday, my mom was getting her hair done and I asked her if it was okay if I got the haircut. And at that point, she wanted to let it grow out a little bit more because she wasn't sure how long it was. And so very last minute I got the okay to get the haircut and so the person who regularly does my hair Terry Lynn she was busy with my mom and she had another person coming in and so she asked Ashley who was the one who did this hair if she could go ahead and give me the haircut and Ashley said sure absolutely and so after a few minutes after I waited for a little bit she said okay Taylor are you ready I'm like yeah I guess so so I went ahead and she measured my hair and I have fully grown out the full 10 inches that are needed for me to grow out and I was able to donate it and that hair will be used for a wig. And I just had the biggest smile on my face from the first start of the haircut to the end of the haircut. And I was so excited, I didn't want to shake or do like, <laughs> you know, stuff like that like I usually do. So I just closed my eyes and once I felt that first snip and once I heard that, I'm like, there is no turning back now. This is actually happening. And I was so excited. And when I first saw that first ponytail, I'm like, oh my gosh. You guys know how you get so surprised and so shocked that you actually start laughing? That was what I was doing. I was laughing, but I was surprised and I was shocked. I was like, oh my gosh, that is my hair. And then she took the second ponytail off and I looked myself in the mirror and I'm like, oh my gosh, the hair is gone. And then after that, Ashley goes ahead and gives me the style of the haircut that I actually picked out for myself, that Terry Lynn, bless her heart, 
has talked my mom into letting me have and this is the end result and I am absolutely in love with this haircut it is so easy to manage and my hair is light and it feels absolutely wonderful on my head it doesn't feel as heavy as my long hair did and it is very easy to style and it's very easy to manage like I said in the beginning of the video I've only told a select few about this haircut so I walk into volunteering the next day and everybody's just like wow your hair looks really good your hair looks so cute in fact one person said oh my gosh you really did get a lot cut off it looks really nice on you and I kept getting compliments the entire day and then the teacher who I volunteered for walks in the office sees me and she's like I, I didn't even tell her about it and just seeing the shock and look of everybody's faces and just hearing them say that it was a very nice haircut made me feel really good and made me feel pretty awesome and then I went to Jillian and I went to her sister Heather who is another one of my very best friends and I showed them and they said that it was really really nice and that it framed my face pretty well and um, Heather said the same thing that her mother who is actually good friends with my mom told me a little bit earlier that she checked her Instagram immediately for the picture and it showed only the two ponytails that I posted and she was like Grr! you know and so I thought yeah I kind of like to keep you guys in suspense that's what I like to do so overall I love the haircut I really love styling it it is so easy to style I mean it's easy I just take a roller brush and a hair dryer and I just go and I just keep doing that until my hair is dry. Like, it's that easy to style. And if I kind of want to texture it up a little bit, here's what I have to do. That's it. That is all I have to do. Easy to style and easy to manage. And I absolutely love it. Well, guys, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up if you guys liked it. Also, in the comments below, let me know if you've ever donated your hair to Wix for Kids or Locks of Love or the organization that Pantene uses. Let me know if you've donated your hair before to any of those organizations. I look forward to reading and replying to your responses below. And finally, as always, if you guys like my videos and want to see more videos from me in the future, go ahead and give this channel a subscribe. Well, guys, that's it for now. Until next time.